The wig that I am installing today is from Ali Pearl Hair. They sent me a 22 inch 13 by 4 HD lace wig, 180 density. This wig was super thick and soft. I loved it immediately. They also sent me a wig cap wig band, a wrap for my hair that I used at nighttime. edge brush, lashes, and a cute headband. Thank you, Ali Pro. You can find all the details in the description. I don't know if I've ever told you guys before, but Quick Blue Bleach is the best bleach to use when bleaching knots. So I just wanted to share that tip with y'all. I started off applying my wig glue using Ghost Bond over my wig cap. And as you guys know, if you're a wig cap is not blending in with your hairline then you should probably do it again i did about two to three coats i usually always do three but i think i did two on this wig apply it evenly to all sides make sure you're wiping the comb off so you don't get the residue stuck on the comb make sure you wait till the glue is completely dry and what i mean by that it's completely clear before you apply a new layer of glue this is the most important tip when using wig glue I use a fan to dry because I like cool air instead of hot air. Before I lay the wig on my head, I use a hot comb to make sure all the hairs are pushed back. And I start with the middle and I work my way to the sides. I use a comb when pushing the wig into the glue just to make sure that everything gets stuck and no hairs get stuck down with the glue. Once one side is laid, go over to the other side and do the exact same thing. Use your comb to just really push the wig into the glue. I use my wig band for the first melt. I tie it in the back. And while that is drying, I'm going through with my blow dryer just to make sure that the hair is completely straight and ready to get pressed out. I remove the wig band and now I'm just going through with my comb and making sure no hairs got stuck down with the glue. I'm going to pull my hair back and I'm going to cut three tabs and now I'm using a razor to cut off the excess lace. Make sure you are going in downward motions to get that jagged edge line look. We don't want it to be too straight and we don't want it to be like too messy. Just go in a downward motion with the razor. After you've cut all the excess lace, use tweezers to get any imperfections that you want to clean up and then go in with your hot comb. Make sure all the hairs are pushed back again. And now it is time for the second melt using Wonder Lace Even Spray and just go in along the hairline and put that all over and put my wig band back on. While that is drying and melting into my skin, I'm going to flat iron my hair.
Okay, so the next two products you're about to use is my wax stick and this amazing silk therapy hair oil. I put a little bit, a little bit goes a long way. Rub it through your hands and then through your hair. Next, I'm using this wax stick to really define my parts. Please don't use too much of the wax stick because it'll make your hair greasy. You just want to use just enough. Take your wig band off and now it is time to pull those baby hairs out but before i do that i just want to make sure that everything is super super flat it's so important that the top of your hair is flat and that hot comb comes in handy as i'm pulling my baby hairs out i go on the side of my face i don't want to go too close to the center because i like my baby hairs on the side I press them with the hot comb just to make sure that they're separate from my hair. I use Pump It Up for the third and final melt and I use just a little bit along the edge line to make sure that everything is flat, flat, flat. Put your wig band back on your head. Make sure you clean up your face because that Pump It Up dripping. Now go in with your hot comb along the perimeter of your hair and use your hot comb to really press through and make sure that everything is laying down correctly. As you guys can see, the wig is so flat to my head and that is what I'm going for with this side part look. I don't want any bumps, I don't want it to be lumpy, I want it to be flat. Take some pump it up, put it in your hands and then put it on top just to get those flyaways. Now I'm really trying to define this part and I'm about to spray some black spray after I put concealer on it. And as you guys can see, look at that part. It is literally so perfect, which is what I'm going for. I'm cutting these baby hairs with the razor and I'm just going in a downward diagonal. After you've cut off all of your baby hairs, you want to curl them up. Some people curl them down, but I choose to curl them up because I think it lays down better that way. So I curl each and every single one of my baby hairs up, and then I'm going to use some gel to hold them down. Now, the key to using the gel, y'all, only put it on the perimeter of the baby hairs. Don't put them on the bottom. Put them on the top. So put them on the top so that it doesn't like make them super flat because we still want that fluffy edge look. We don't want them to be pasted to our head. So as you can see, I just put them on the top and use my comb and you have to play with it. It literally took me like 10 minutes to get my baby hairs exactly right, but you guys aren't going to see that whole process. I just showed you a little bit. Okay guys, so this is this wig all the way installed. As you can see, it is super thick, like super, super thick. The density was 180 on this wig, but honestly, the, it's feeling like it's 200. Let me get in close and show you guys how melted my lace is. Like, on a scale of one to 10, this wig is probably a 9.5. The lace and the knots bleached so good. I only had to bleach it one time, which most wigs I have to bleach it like two to three times. I don't tell y'all to shop with any other brand. Y'all need to shop with Ali Pearl because this hair is super, super amazing. If y'all could feel it through the camera, like, like y'all look at this. What fucking lace? Like I'm a little close though, maybe you can, but bitch, when I back up, what lace? Like, 
this wig is amazing it's everything so make sure you guys go shop with Ali Pearl link in the description thank you guys for watching this far and I hope I taught you something how to slay your wigs cuz girl look mm. period